Hello! Welcome back to World of Warships. I said the next video is going to be something with torpedoes so I could get a little bit more torpedo practice. I wasn't expecting it to be this. This is the tier 30 Zaya. This is uh, Wargaming's April joke. It's not April Fools anymore, I guess, but whatever. Uh, this is effectively, as far as I'm aware, the Sinjo. With some, I think, probably minor modifications. I don't know. Maybe no modifications at all, but it's basically the Sinjo. This is a reference to an anime, if you're unaware. But anyway, uh, this is the ship we will be doing this video for giggles. It has a uh, 203-something unigun. It's millimeter, but it doesn't actually list that. And it also makes no sense. As well as some of these, which have an 8km range and go quite fast. That doesn't mean I know how to aim them, but they're there. <laughs> Excuse me. I suddenly had to sneeze. But anyway, let's go ahead and see if we can get into battle. The answer is maybe. It looks like we can actually... I suppose this makes sense, but we can actually get into battles with two tens? Well, that shake technically that doesn't make sense. That doesn't make any sense, but whatever. So as I said, this is Wargaming's April joke. Uh... It'll be in for, I think, two more days, and then they'll chop it out, and we'll get to keep the garage slots, or the port slots, or not. Obviously, it's not a garage, but you know what I mean. So that's nice. The more astute among you might also notice that I have 90 days of premium and a bunch of other bollocks going on in my port. That's also a thing. But anyway, so they actually put in uh, five different tier 30s. I think it's actually all of the tier 10s they have, but I'm not sure. Oh no, it's not. It's missing one of the destroyers. They had the Flyfire, which is a US destroyer. The Zaya, which is a Japanese cruiser. The Galaxy, which is a US cruiser. The Enterprise, which is a US carrier. And the Yamato, if you don't know what the Yamato is, balls. So, we're in space. Uh, it's the same exact game, it's just we're in space. The uh, tricksy part, it's actually kind of difficult to aim in this because you can see below, quote unquote, the water line on the boat. So I actually don't really want to be out here by myself. I do want to launch my plane, though. Have at ye plane. So... Let's see, there's a galaxy... I don't know if I want to shoot at anything quite yet. Let's shoot at that. With our laser beams that travel at the exact same speed as everything else, I should be firing AP. Someone freaking damaged my torpedo rack. It's this is Aya. Let's see if I can do some evasive man waivers here. To get out of this is Aya's effective firing arcs here. I guess we'll keep firing at this galaxy. We may as well. Especially if we're going to keep hitting him in the citadel like that. That'll make it a lot easier. Although I aimed far to the right there. Yeah. Should have actually aimed left and not right. I've gotten a little bit more used to aiming in this mode. You can see how it can be a bit tricky because at range, you can see the boats, uh, you know, below the boat's water line. So a lot of the times I end up aiming at something that I really shouldn't be aiming at. I am now on fire. I suppose I should do something about that. There's their carrier. And he stopped, basically. So they're harassing the crap out of me, which is unfortuitous. I'm the only one over here for some reason. I 
I don't know why I'm the only one over here. But I am. I should have spun my turrets earlier. No. I also want to fire some torpedoes. If possible. That was too close. See, I hit the water there, but it's impossible to bloody tell. I think my plane landed, didn't it? No? Yes. Maybe. I don't know. That guy's dead. There are capture points on the map. It seems like people either can't see the capture points or intentionally avoid the capture points because they just want to shoot spaceships with space lasers. Could be mistaken though and people just can't see it because there's no marker on the, uh, the space. <laughs> there's no marker marking where the uh, capture point is. It is on the map, I'm aware of that much, but, you know. That was a decent volley. He's turning now, though. Are any of those going to hit? I don't know, I can't see because of lasers. Oh yeah, nice. I hit his turret, so it did god-awful damage, but still. And that's too far to the right. Well, I hit his turret again. I have noticed at this tier that turrets break a lot. Like, alarming frequency. I was about to say, I, I, that wasn't me, but no, there's a dude right behind me, so... I, seriously though, I still would like to actually shoot torpedoes or something. But I'm always too far away. There's some fighters. I believe my scout... Yeah, my scout has landed, so he is safe. I'm gonna see if I can... No target detect. He's right there. Detect the crap out of him. Okay. I'm gonna head in this direction. I'm going to completely ignore C because I don't tend to capture points in this mode. This is a 4 giggles mode. I would... I am a tier 10 cruiser. I would activate my anti-air ability, but those are only fighters, so... They're not of that much of a threat that I'm going to activate my anti-air ability. That thing has like a 2 minute cooldown, so... Now, if I was on the left side, where it looked like all of the torpedo bombers this match were, I probably would have activated my ability. This isn't going to hit on my list, I'm going to get close. Maybe it will get close. It hit where he used to be. I can't aim far enough ahead of him to actually hit him though, so... It do not matter. There's their... There's Carrier 1, and there's Carrier 2. Now for Carriers, you generally should be firing HE so that they cannot launch aircraft. It's also really hard to hit the freaking Enterprise because I don't know where its waterline is. Or how fast it can go. He's apparently going quite slowly. And I shot over him there, I think. It's still shooting over him. Ah well, we'll just sit here and volley for a bit. I'll go ahead and launch my scout too. Oh, he's starting to cruise now, yeah. He is mobile. I should capture this point in the middle. If only to neutralize it. Let's go ahead and load AG. I wish I hadn't moved where my camera was so I could actually remember how to shoot at this dude. 
We'll fire a leading shot here. Guiding shot, whatever. That hit, so we'll fire all of the other shots. And we are capturing B now. We'll go ahead and turn into B a little bit. He's on fire. He immediately used his repair kit. He also launched planes. I saw them lift off. Thing. Oh, come on. All of those shots and he didn't light on fire again. Come on, man. Come on. We're, we're not going to get to fire torpedoes at all this this run, apparently. Oh, I killed him with HE. There are some torpedo bombers going for my other cruiser friends by the look of things here. I'm not fussed about them. I will continue going in a generally thisward direction here. And he's turning, so even if I do fire a tracing shot here. Is that too far? Oh, I actually set him on fire. Fantastic. We're just going to spread shots over there in that general direction and see how that goes. We lit him on fire again, and this time he doesn't have a repair kit to put it out. So why you got to be careful with your repair kit usage? Because now he's going to be on fire for quite some time. There's a bunch of dive bombers. This guy must have went full, like, damage output bombers set up instead of fighters. Because he's got two dive bombers and a torpedo bomber out right now. And he's on fire, so he's probably got something waiting to launch. Let's get my other guns back. I didn't realize I had spun that far around. I'm trying to catch up to this dude, but... He's freaking fast. And I wish he wasn't... I'm also shooting at some fighters for you to go see how I turn. Let's see if we can do anything about this dude. He's over here dodging torpedoes. As you do. I'm gonna try to light this guy on fire. Oh, he's already on He's already dead. I was gonna say, try to light him on fire. He's already on fire and he's already dead. That's gonna miss. Well, I guess we're not shooting torpedoes this time. Maybe our second match we'll be able to fire torpedoes or something. It's actually... is he... yeah, that's gonna go over. I thought he was still going away from me. I don't know. That was my bad. It looks like he's actually starting to turn back into us because he's hit that corner. That just... no, he's on fire again. Fantastic. <laughs> The joys! That destroyer is just volleying shots. Look at him. It's just a constant stream coming off of that destroyer. Alright, well, we won. There you go. I am Winrar. Third place? Fourth place? Fifth place on the team, apparently. I thought I did better than that. I did better than their team, to be fair, but hey. Lots of HE damage. Because of those volleys in the last bit there. Really didn't kill very many aircraft though, which is unfortunate. Oh well. We'll click battle on, head back out with our ship, boat, space battle, cruiser, not Yamato. Let's see if we can actually get into a match where we fire torpedoes at something this time. Which we probably won't. We're probably going to have to play the destroyer to actually do that. The destroyer is like... Unless it's safe, you're probably just going to be trying to be sneaky and shoot torpedoes. And this is a wide open map, so it's not very good for destroyers. That being said, it does have really good... Conceal... Concealment. I was going to say concealability, but... Concealment is a better word for that. Holy crap. I can tell you something right now, 
There's gonna be some torpedoes. Oh, it's not gonna let me... Darn it, it's not gonna let me zoom in to the other turret. Oh well, we'll just look at these turrets. Mmm, turrets. Let's zoom out. So there are... A lot. There's eight fly fires. Now, fly fires only have two... I think they might be quad torps? Quad torpedoes? I'm actually gonna rotate turrets this way. We're gonna turn right. I do not... That he's already shooting. You're a destroyer, man. What are you doing? I do not want to be out front in this match. I'm alright being out front when I'm being shot at by freaking cruisers. Not so much Yamados, but you know. There's a reason for that. But, you know, torpedoes, man. They hurt a lot. So how is he not in my range yet? Oh, he's right outside of it. Okay. There he goes. Let's go ahead and volley off some miscellaneous HE in that general direction, and we'll load up some AP. I'm probably going to have HE loaded for a lot of this map. Should have aimed further to the right, it looks like. Is he turning? Is that what's going on here? He's turning, isn't he? Yes, he is. I still clipped him, but that didn't really do anything for us. That's too far. It's actually not far enough, is it? No. It looks like I'm gonna end up have to, having to play over there. They have, yeah, they have one Enterprise. Where is his? I should really be turning sooner than this. Where are all his planes? This rock, this uh, lovely thing here, doesn't actually have proper modeling, it seems. You can get stuck on the side of it a lot, so we're probably going to end up being stuck over here. In fact, we are going to end up being stuck over here anyway, because we're going to hit this edge of it right here. Which is unfortunate. Yeah, there she goes. Sigh. Let's go ahead and launch my plane. It looks like that destroyer hit it, too. It's a common problem to hit this thing in the center. Mostly from people not paying attention like me, but you know. Hello, friend. This could be real bad, by the way. For both him and me. Now, he fired his torpedoes at someone else. Looks like. Or he thought I was moving. He's also now dead. I thought I was... Did I get stuck on the... Ah, oh, I got the freaking back of the boat stuck. We may just be stuck here. Oop. Hey! Nope. Alright, well... Our aircraft are under attack. Am I shooting at someone? Someone is. I think you can fire anti-air through this, by the way, if you're curious. There's another destroyer. Can I get off of this rock? Can I get off of Mr. Bone's wild ride? Is that an option? Let's see if I can volley a bit of spread over there. Come on, boat. You can do it. Whoa, hey, we're out. There's also a dude behind us. Uh, 
Can I turn fast enough that these torpedoes will be of any use at all? Probably not. We're gonna fire some there, and then we're going to not fire the rest and shoot our guns. He's on to our torpedoes. He's not on to our guns. No, now he's on to us. So we're gonna go ahead and fire the rest of the torpedoes. He knows I fire them the instant I fire them because of how this map works, so he's gonna turn back the other way. Yeah. Which is unfortunate. It's it's real hard to hit people with torpedoes in this. You can see torpedoes instantly, basically. Oh good, my freaking turret bird. It's a common problem, by the way, is turret breakage. Oh, we have four torpedo launchers? I really don't want to be here, by the way, if you're curious. Is my engine broke? Maybe? Why can't I move? Problem solved, sir! Oh, that's why I can't move. There's a dude on me. How long has he been there? Excuse me. Sir. Can I... Can I back up off of him? Is that an option? Well, we got some serious anti-air cover over here. I'm also dead. I can't stop going forward, by the way. Oh, I stopped. I'm dead, by the way. <laughs> Hello, sir. Well, that was unfortunate. Or how long he's been there. I was sitting there trying to turn. I'm like, I can't turn. And I started trying to stop. I can't stop. Just started trying to go forward. Couldn't do that either. I was very confused. And then it turned out I had a boat stuck on me. He's gonna run into me again, isn't he? Yes. <laughs> yes, he was. Rude. Is that Fred? Yeah, it is. I don't think he said anything else in chat. I can't freaking see back in chat, though, which is unfortunate. I think he may have just been stuck on me. I'm sure he was trying to back up. These boats have a little bit weird modeling because they're like the... What is that white dot over there? Is that like a torpedo that fell off the map or something? What is that? It stopped. I don't know what it is. Either way, he may have been stuck on me. The, um... The spaceships have some odd models because of how they're... De how derpy they're designed, but whatever. It's not a problem. It's a fun mode. I'm just goofing around. A victory with the Zaya! And all the credits ever. But either way, that's gonna be it for this video. We fired absolutely no torpedoes, so to make up for that, we're gonna run the fire... F the fly fire, the firefly. That'd be the correct name, it's not the name they use. But either way, we're gonna run the fly fire next time, so thanks for watching. See you then.